Hi, my name is Carla Liao. I'm 37 years old. I was born in Venezuela, but I've been living in the United States for many years now. Small boobs are light, wonderful, simple, fresh, but most importantly, small boobs are only for confident women. Yes, actually, I gotta be very honest with you. I did consider it in the past when I was gonna go through my breast explant surgery, but the risk associated with the surgery itself made me very scared. And also, I wasn't sure uh, my health will be optimal if I did this. And after I researched the risks and the possible consequences and results, I decided not to do it. And I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm happy I didn't do it. I feel comfortable right now. I feel good. If I ever consider doing this, if I change my mind, because this is life, we're human. Sometimes we say something, change our mind. That's why I don't, I, I don't like to say I would never do something. But if I ever would consider that surgery for enlargement, I would probably consider only a fat transfer surgery. But at this time of my life, I feel fine. I feel happy. I feel in peace with who I am and with my breast size. I think people who make fun of other people and are always talking negatively about other people are very insecure people, are people that need a lot of love and their ego is really making their life miserable. So the way I deal with these type of people who are negative and toxic people, I call, it, I call these people energetic vampires. Um, I simply ignore these people and push them away. I have ignored so many people in my life and pushed them away from my life because I have considered these people are negative and nothing negative is good for your life. So you always want to keep yourself with people who accept you as you are, with the small boobs that you are, with who you are, with how you are. So the best way to deal with negative people is ignoring them and let them go. Simply being confident about who I am, being authentic. There is no need to be somebody else. There is no need to be different. The only need is to be myself and to be mindful towards me, my body, and towards others. I think authenticity, confidence, and mindfulness is what makes me feel comfortable on my own skin.